everyone this is Debbie with the food prepping channel and today I'm going to show y'all how to do something and I hope this is going to work because um, I got another one and it I never could get it to do what I wanted it to do so I have gotten a lodge this is a 12 inch lodge cast iron skillet um, this is the one that I use this was my grandmother's well i gotta rinse this one out um this was my grandmother's i don't know if you can well let me get y'all back here this one was my grandmother's this is like a 10 inch or a 9 inch but this is what i fixed my cornbread in this only thing this is used for is my cornbread i don't use it for anything else i have no idea how old this is it doesn't have anything on the bottom but a it's either a six or a nine it must be the nine for a nine inch is the only thing i can figure out but this has got to be at least 75 years old and this has been seasoned nothing my cornbread wouldn't stick to this for nothing <laughs> i couldn't make my cornbread stick to this it has been seasoned so well and so i want this pot to be seasoned that well and i don't really i'm gonna do what i have been told to do but this is a large 12 inch and i got the little handle thing to go on it and i'll have this link down below i got it from amazon so um like i said pretty much everything that i have linked down below my videos i use in my kitchen and um so what i'm going to do is I right now I've got my oven preheated to 400 I am going to fry some bacon in here I'm going to use that grease and I'm going to um, rub all around I'm gonna fry the bacon in then I'm gonna rub the grease all around this I'm gonna put this in the oven and let this get like really really hot and lodge are supposed to come pre-seasoned but just for the benefit of the doubt I'm gonna season it myself I, I want to make sure that it is seasoned correctly and the other one that I got was not a lodge and I could never get it seasoned and I did everything I used shortening I did this I did that I put um, oil all over it I turned it upside down I did everything and it's still um, rust so I'm hoping that this lodge this lodge looks way way better than the other one did I cannot remember what the name of the other one was but it wasn't a lodge so I went on and got the lodge because supposedly lodges lodge is supposed to be one of the best so I'm going to go on and fry this. I'm going to cut this bacon up into little pieces, and I'm going to fry it in here and save the bacon pieces. So I will bring you back. Okay, y'all. All right, I'm frying this bacon, and I swear the same thing is happening. Look at this. It is stuck uh, to the bottom of this. I mean, it is just on here, and I, I was always, I've always read that it's the best thing to fry the first time in it is bacon, and that's what I'm going to do. Was doing, and it has just stuck all to it. So now I'm going to have to um, put a liquid in here <laughs> to get this off of the bottom of it. So. Um, I don't know. I'm going to let this bacon continue frying up, and I'll bring y'all back. Okay, y'all. The bacon sticking did not work, um, so I just went on. I knew I was going to have to deglaze this pan, so I just wanted to fix some eggs in it. And now to deglaze this pan, I've got it on sear, and I'm going to put this water in here, and hopefully... <laughs> that is going to get the eggs off of here and then i'm going to take some oil and a tissue and i'm once i get all of this stain off i'm going to take 
um, a tissue and I mean some paper towels and I'm gonna rub all I want it and I'm gonna put it in my oven for about 30 30 to 45 minutes and get it really hot and hope that that's okay and I'm just gonna have to work with this um, pan I <laughs> I don't know if I will ever get my pan like my grandma had hers, but I'm hoping that I can. But anyway, I'm going to go on and deglaze this pan. You can see once it gets hot, it's the eggs and all, and then hopefully the bacon is going to come off. And then I'm just going to rinse it all out and dry it off, then put the oil on it and put it in the oven for 30 to 45 minutes. And I'll bring y'all back and show you what it looks like.